Hey guys, how's it going? This is Prophet. Just before this video begins, I wanted to let everybody know, sorry for not uploading as much. I'm really busy with life as it is at the moment. It's very, like, stressful, and I just want to be able to put out good videos for you guys where I have good vibes and not really trying to bring any of my real life stuff into the videos that I create for you to laugh to and, you know, have fun. But sometimes real life just mixes up and I can't run away from it. Um, just been thinking about some things and trying to be better at other things in my life, like getting, you know, my life together. So that's going to be a while before I can do any, you know, insane changes, but please just enjoy the videos, like, subscribe, it's free, and it totally helps me out, and I appreciate everything you guys do, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. We're playing Super Liminal, and it's a really fun game, I promise. Check this out. Oh, that's so dumb, man. Oh! Oh! Oh, my foot fell asleep. This isn't good. Give me a second, chat. I'll be back with you in a moment, right after I beat the, f the fudge out of my foot. Come here, foot. I'm God. Huh, huh, huh. Ooh, imagine whatever you want to do, like just like close your eyes for this part. Don't close your eyes for this part. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Wake up! Wake up! Damn it! Do I have to walk around now? Ah, oh, nope. It's fine. All right. Listen, I said the D word already. Okay, I'm gonna try not to cuss in this. Ooh. Okay. Hold up. I need to turn down the audio a bit though because of, you know, recording and shit. No, it was the moment when I seen her for the first time and I took her by the hand. Do me a favor, please. Get out of here. Get out of here, man. Sh I'm saying. I don't fucking know. Alright. Ah, fudge. I cussed again. All right, let's try this. Photosensitive seizure warning. This is your guys' this is this is like your guys' thing, you know. If you have seizures, please do not watch this video for I am Are not you responsible. With feelings of self-doubt. Do you find yourself prone to minimizing massive dilemmas or for allowing the smallest problems to get blown completely out of proportion? Yeah. The Pierce Institute, our patent pending somnoscope technology, provides safe and effective dream therapy. I don't think this is going to be safe. Comfort of our I have a feeling, chat. Located right next to the secondary overflow parking lot at the University Medical Center. Somnoscope will make your dreams come true. Awesome. Thank you. And see if that feels better. So am I dreaming? Am I dreaming yet, Mr. Kramps? <sighs> oh, terms of sir. Uh, uh, I haven't even read it. Uh, uh. My bad. Hold up. Twenty. This is fine. Yeah, this is fine. All right, cool beans. Um, so we're just in the game, and wow, dang! Oh wow! Oh. Awesome. Oh. It shrunk again. Okay, sorry. I got really distracted by... Oh, jump. Hell yeah. Terms of service accepted. <laughs> Congratulations on falling asleep. Welcome to Somnasculpt. Your progress may be monitored by qualified specialists. 
This orientation will adapt you to eyelids, our interactive, lucid induction dream state in which you retain full consciousness and control. Okay. Cool beans. No objects beyond this point at all times. What if I grab this object and I did that? It didn't say chess boards. And we're in. Alright, cool. It did not say anything about chess boards. I guess it did. Damn it. Oh. Nice. All right, cool. We're not that dumb. Oh, then I go grab this one back. And then I make it huge. Awesome sauce. Confirmed. You can move wow. forward, interact with surrounding objects, and listen to messages from your patient care team. Please note okay. that I am the standard orientation protocol, and that my voice has been explicitly chosen to remind you that I am not a part of your patient care team. I do not care. Uh, okay. I did not need that sass, though. Fuck. Dang it. Okay, dope. Move to the next room, to the next room, to the next room. All right, all right. Oh, piece of cake. It's cheese. It's cheese. Oh, so I gotta make like stairs then. Oh, yes, I do. Go up the cheese. During eyelids, you will lose the ability to awaken suddenly due to realizing that this is a dream. Evidence. Okay. I have already informed you that this is a dream. You did not wake up. Please complete okay. the remaining orientation activities. Warning, you have deviated from the orientation pathway. At the Pierce okay. Institute, patient safety is a keynote in our corporate priority tetrahedron. A variable degree of force can and will be authorized to ensure patient safety. Please return to the orientation pathway. Some high and what? Yeah, but we're just gonna keep going, man. Like, that's kind of freaky, though. Huh? Ah, let's go. All we environments perceived down. during eyelids should reflect a typical mental state. If you believe your okay. mental state was compromised by Somnasculpt, please provide a comprehensive, rational explanation in your post-procedural survey. Completed surveys may be eligible for a gift card. What? Yes. Let's 
Let's go. Oh, the exit. Oh, we're close, baby. What if I... And then all I need to do is fall this side? Other way, other way, other way. Fall, man. Come on. Dude, it's so close. Damn it. Ha! Big fucking W's, boys. Please I said stand by for again. polite recognition on your completion of the Somna Sculpt orientation. You did it. To maximize the time allotted for your therapeutic journey, please do not delay in proceeding through the final doorway as indicated. Huh? Is there like a wall I can break or something? Is this the wall that's supposed to like break but didn't break all the way? Awesome. I need this piece of cheese on my side. You are my friend now, Cheese. And I will call you Cheese. Alright, Cheese. We must explore out here together. Me and Cheese, all the way. Nothing can scare me. I don't even think this is supposed to be a scary game. But I know I need the cheese for something. I'm going to make sure the cheese is with me. Ah! Okay. I don't think I was supposed to be scared there, but my pussy ass got scared. <sighs> I don't I don't think I was supposed to be so ooh. Show me what it do. Show me what it mean. Hold on, let me crack this ghost real quick, please. Oh yeah, baby. Ah. Oh. Stop it. Neighbor. 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 My friend. <laughs> Private. Nice. Huh. I got a Coca-Cola. I do sure love me some Coca-Cola. Ooh, peaceful music. This means nothing bad will happen. Left or right? Left or right? Oh, looks like we dig a left here. Then another right. Oh, let me... There you go. <laughs> let me just take the door. <laughs> Don't bother me. Just taking the door here. We're just going to walk away with it. That's one way. What's over here? In the days. Whoa, what? Boss battle? Exit that way. Exit that way. Exit this way? Exit 
that way. Is the exit in the middle? The exit is in the middle. I think. I can't grab anything, sadly. Oh, I can. Damn. I made that a bit too big. <laughs> Oopsie daisy. Okay. What do you mean? <laughs> oh, here you are, big fella. Uh, bridge. Make bridge. No, make bridge. <laughs> My bridge. All right. Fuck. All right. Fuck. All right. Fuck. All right. Fuck. All right. All right. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. And I'd like okay. to talk to you about being special. So special, mm. in fact, that we have <laughs> no idea where you are. But not to worry. We're working on it. Huh? This sounds like a stress... Like... Boy, I know how these things work. Oh, shit. That's cool. Alright, we're gonna jump on this. Boom. Look at that, Mario Brothers. Call me the baby. What? Whoa. That there was a caffeinated beverage. Um, nope, this isn't it. There's a vase supposed to be there. Where is this vase? Unless I look at it from a different angle. I don't get it. Where's the potted plant? That looks to be the potted plant, correct? I think so. It's not even a full book. It's not even like a full block. Where would I have to see this from to like get a better understanding? Oh, it kind of just forced me into it right there. I made giant door. All right, back to ambiance. Oh, another box. Hello, 
My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'm just popping in to give you a quick update on where you are. Okay. We still don't know. But what? please keep moving forward, and hopefully you prefer frequent updates to being reminded that you are completely lost. Fuck you. That's a dick. Numbers, Mason. What are the numbers? Okay, so we're in a place that they don't know where I am. And I'm in a place that I don't know where I am either. So cool. It's just a double doink. Is that a mirror or mirror on the wall? Here we are again. To my rise and fall. To be my only friend. Some think I can't understand the man I am. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ooh. Sorry. Oh, I'm trying to think, how the fuck do I get up there? I need to get up there. It's crazy, I can't grab a majority of these things. Like, why can't I grab a box? Okay, let me think. This one's emitting light. <laughs> I don't like that. But it's like lit up like I should be noticing that. Oh, motherfucker. Oh shit. Look at that chat. Oh, make it a bit smaller. There we go, baby. Disconnect power before opening condenser fan grill. Well, for my mind, that didn't make sense. Never mind, that makes sense. <laughs> For a dream, it does perfect English. Looks as to be a movie set. Oh, hello, Box. Tell me good news. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and we still can't find you. But you Damn should it. now have access to a series of elevators that should trigger your subconscious to gradually wake you up. And you if I don't? You should also find a variety of emergency exit signs that should lead you to them. Will all of this work? Absolutely. Oh. Oh, thanks for answering my question. All right, new room. All right, where the hell is the puzzle this time? The moon? The moon, maybe? Do I grab... Th I grab the... Okay. Let me just say, I've never played this game before. This is my first... What's on the moon? There's something on the moon, bruh. There's something on the moon, bruh. Why is it just suspended in air? If I make it big enough, does it have its own... Oh, shit. Hello, 
My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. In mm -hmm. the event that this elevator does not wake you up, please don't interact with anything that strikes you as psychologically significant, as we will no longer have any way of controlling it. For example, huh? if you see your parents, please punch them in the face as hard as you can and immediately run away. What? I have a block and I'm not afraid to use it. I have a block. Oh, oh. Oh. Whoa. Fuck. I gotta blur bleep out some of these F words. Do I gotta really restart, man? Nope, this is not restarting. This is an automated message for all patients who attempted to use an alternate pathway to access the next phase of Somnasculpt therapy, but who have become trapped in a dream state paradox instead. Your decision. This hap Does this happen multiple times? Imply a failure of orientation, which reflects negatively on the standard orientation protocol. You will rectify this failure immediately. Huh? Or what? He won't do nothing. Tell you right now, boy. All right, dice. You're gonna come back. Well, die. Oh, well, don't die. Can I get a six? Yes. <laughs> Ready. Oh! Okay. Okay. Professional tip, the average adult can only withstand three to five dreams per night. Once this threshold is eclipsed by entering more dreams, your mind will suffer an explosive mental overload, reorienting you for the emergency exit protocol. Please subject yourself to explosive mental overload. Now you want me to do it? You just tell me not to. Fake dice. Cool trick. You will not get me again. I promise. You will not do it. Huh? What the fuck? Oh, that's kind of cool. Ow! Alright, now we put this down. Yep. And then we...
Please note that a reluctance to volunteer for the risks associated with explosive mental overload implies a misunderstanding of all other solutions, all of which Whoa. are far more traumatic and likelier to result in catastrophe. I am not capable of suboptimal suggestions. Please exit this dream as soon as possible. Okay. Huh. I'm gonna probably need one of you. Yep. Okay. Um. Saying that this is the exit? Okay, this is the exit, I guess. Wow. All right. Neat party trick. Feel lucky, so are we. <laughs> All right. Alright. This looks more similar to the first map. Oh, the radio. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. And despite touring the Waterfall Serenity Zone in the previous section you've just completed, you may still be experiencing feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt. Why okay. do you feel like everything is going wrong, even when the sun is shining? Sometimes you just gotta ask the most important questions. Why am I not loved? Fucking hell. <laughs> I know why I'm not loved. I play. I don't fuck around. Nope. I just go forward. I'm just going straight. I'm not even going to look behind me. Why? Because I know it's the death of me. The moment I fucking do. Not turn around. Not doing it. I'm just going to go straight. There's nothing stopping me from just going straight. There's something stopping me from going straight. Just keep going. Did I trap myself? Did I trap myself? Am I going to get scared? Murder? Chat, this one from 0 to 100 really quickly. I don't know what to do. Beans. I'm scared shitless right now. You guys have absolutely no clue. I'm I don't like the dark. Okay. I mean that's cool and all but this doesn't help me. This does. This looks like an escape. Diet. Oh, I thought it said die. It said diet soda. Fuck. Mother sucker. Alright, nope. That's just a downward spiral can't go that way either ah, so you see chief I'm not trying to have play these games
Oh. 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 Leave a faith. All I could do was give the leap of faith, man. The leap of faith. This is the end to it, right? Mother. Okay, there's no bridge on this side over here, but there is a bridge on this side. So we're going to take this one, we're going to keep going, we're going to jump once, right? And then we're going to jump. That's not it. I don't know what we need to do here, but we need to do something and fast. Because there's obviously something here with us that doesn't like us that much. So we're going to jump this way. Mother f Damn it. Okay, the left path. Oh. That light's crazy. Uh-oh. Hello. My name is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like to talk more about the feelings of worthlessness and self-doubt I mentioned before. You uh -huh. feel this way because you want the kind of happy life you see all around you. The kind you know everyone else is enjoying. And uh -huh. that's exactly why we're here to help. Uh-huh. What is with the blood? Dark corner, don't like it. Fuh. Howdy, buddy. How you doing? Oh, nice trick. I can't grab a horsey? <sighs> More blood. This just is like... It seems inviting. Dark. Dark. Dark and... Terrifying. Fuck it. Oh, dude, it's dark in there, man. Like, I don't like the darkness. I'm not scared of the dark. I'm scared of what's in it. But, fuck. I'm just gonna walk backwards, dog, because I'm not playing these games. It said to the right. It was not to the right. Where do I go from here? If I can't see what scares me, am I really scared? Oh! Stairs! Light! Something! Please, for the love of Christ! Holy shit! Warning! You were advised to subject yourself to explosive mental overload by descending into additional uh -huh. dreams, but have now descended into a dream within a dream instead, disorienting yourself even further. You are responsible for failing to make this crucial distinction. Man, I don't know about the dreams, man. I don't know about dreams, man. I know someone who had a dream. Can I not get through this, or is this like a, this like a, what is this going to do? Oh, a light. Wait. Oh, well, let me bring it over there. Oh, there's a dark spot over here.
It's a fucking brick wall. There's nothing in there. Dude, this game is keeping me on my toes. I'll tell you what. This game is really keeping me on my toes. I see it now. Did you know that unintentional multi-dream layering occurs in less than 1% of patients? This correlates strongly with the 99% of patients who are able to follow simple instructions from the standard Man. orientation protocol. Bro, why are you roasting me? Oh! Way to just tickle my tender. This is a lot of blood. Ikea. Oh. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It was paint the whole time. I thought I was going to die, but I didn't die. <laughs> I thought I was going to die, man. I didn't die. Huh. Eggshell? <laughs> Man. Time for another elevator. Now what happens if I see my parents? Why is there no me? <laughs> I can't even see me. Enjoy avocados. I do actually enjoy avocados. Avocados are good, especially on burgers. I don't know if y'all ever had burgers with avocado on it, but that shit goes hard. Uh, my bad. Um, let's continue on this perilous, on this fucking meaningless trip. Um, because it's going to happen over and over again, and I'm just going to like, you know... Think it's blood. No, it was paint the whole time. Way to prank me, game. Ha ha hee hee. Fucking door over there. Are we sure the exit's over here this time? Because, like, last time? Yeah. Oh, it's all staples to the ground. Oh no. Ah, fuck. <laughs> okay, one sec. Oh. Oh. Ah, it died. <laughs> Sad enough to say, it died. Where's cheese? I need my friend cheese. Boy. Bobby, I told you I didn't want to invade Iraq. Hold up. Think. Think. Think, 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 think. You're able to think, right? I'm able to think. Hold up. Bro, thinking is not in my thing no more. I've lost thinking capabilities. Yellow bucket? No, not yellow bucket. Oh, we're just gonna use the door. <laughs> ha. Boy. Hey. 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 Listen to me one time. What's happening? <laughs> what is this? So many doors. That's gonna crush my game or something. I just know it. Mother. <laughs> no, please. <laughs> please, no. <laughs> I 
Oh no. Oh, use them as stairs. That makes so much sense. Oh man. Let's go to heaven. No, oh, this is not heaven. Attention, Dr. Pierce requires you to note the following risks of dream overexposure. Significant memory loss. Oh, please no, please no, please no. Hallucinations of dreaded or annoying objects. Unrealistic beliefs about the lengths of hallways. And other side effects which have not yet been discovered or which cannot be understood. Please stop. Oh no. Oh no. Who whistled? Why is there a smiley face? As my dot. It's a smiley face. This is not this is not me, right? I'm not tripping. That's a smiley face. Kinda of psychedelics and this shit had me ass. Oh Okay, that didn't make me have a smile. It just there was just a smile there for a little bit. I thought it would just, you know, like redo it or something, but nope. These guys are smart. Oh, there's an apple. Huh. No fair. Huh. What if I used one apple to knock the other apple out the way? Damn. Big chunky. Bro, brain too big, penis too small. Wait a minute, what? <laughs> I'm sorry. Hold up. <laughs> About to say, yeah, that shit don't do nothing to me. I spent so much time on that. Warning. Dr. Pierce is frantically submitting numerous spelling and grammar mistakes into the standard orientation <coughs> protocol in a desperate attempt to counsel you. I have no subroutine to correct these errors, but I cannot compromise the integrity of the standard orientation protocol. You will not receive these messages. They would not make sense regardless. I bet. I bet. I'm just making it worse, honestly. Oh no, I'm not. I guess that would happen. Attention, Dr. Pierce continues to input significant errors. I will interpret his basic ideas. Hello, my introductions are redundant. I am a real doctor who went to doctor school. VR has never been a mistake. I can help you, but I also do not know how. Transmission ends. Wow. Wow. Hello. Name is my Pierce Dr. Glenn. To the Somnusculpt Welcome Experience, team of your care leader, patient years 10 development. Conditions struggle you whatever with? Professional invention. Edge science with cutting, a tomorrow can bright. And buts, no ifs, or look good. I speak English. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Jesus Christ, I didn't order a single. No, I understood it all. I'm just fucking around. What if I forget to set the alarm?
I should go back and see if I need to set an alarm. I didn't see nothing on the way here. Phil's Friendly Family Produce. Nice. Oh, 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 it's tricking me. Oh, oh, oh. Uh. <sighs> huh. Relaxation room. Don't mind if I do. Oh, uh, howdy. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. This is a notification that you have reappeared on our monitoring system after a prolonged absence. Please continue to do whatever you did most recently and discontinue whatever you were doing. All right, well, relaxation room, not too relaxing. Especially because there was a therapist in there. So I had to go through this way. Room's pretty big, though. Oh, nice. Rather not be too big, you know? Just enough where I bump my fucking forehead on the fucking top of the door. My brain, like, did a little backflip and then just danced. <laughs> what the hell just happened? <laughs> my brain took a break to break dance. Man, my stream is still fucking tripping, man. Jesus. Like, I can't do anything funny. Because of shit. All right. Are these fucking fake door? Those are fake doors. All right, so we're going to make this house even bigger. Okay, maybe a bit smaller. See, this looks a bit better. I was thirsty. Okay, I see that I see it now. I see why I needed to be a really big house. This game, dude. Hello, my name is Dr. Glenn Pierce. In addition Hello. to continuing and discontinuing as mentioned earlier, 
please also disregard any unsettling experiences that you may have recently had. Everything okay. should have now reverted to being soothing and therapeutic. If this is not the case, you may be receiving this message in error. Huh. Yeah, I wasn't part of that. Big ass game of Jenga. Big ass game of Jenga. Break the walls down. Y'all ain't never heard of Chris Jericho. Wet like your mother. <laughs> eh. I understand my flaws as a person and a human. <laughs> Why the hell are the doors so tiny? Oh. Oh, let's go. Big W's. Okay, little locker room with some showers. Welcome to the Gulag. Fight your way to live. Um, Hello, my name hi. is Dr. Glenn Pierce, and I'd like uh, to so read my favorite inspirational quote by me. The worst thing you can do is focus on negativity. <sighs> It won't spare you from the cage of death, the pain of disease, the cruelty of time, the cold shell of human nature, or the eventual loss of everything you've ever held dear. Whatever you do, don't focus on that. I now have crippling depression. <laughs> Bro just brought it out of me. Okay. Okay, so I just go back outside and make this. Man, we might have to cut this short, people, because my stream is, like, literally dying on me. Come on. Gotta restart from scratch now. Fuck. 
work. All right. After this puzzle, we're going to end it. All right, we're gonna end it off right here, guys, because one, it's almost been two hours. Oh, it's been an hour 31. And plus, um, I'm not trying to play too much of this game. One more thing, because the VOD is just gonna be completely fucked by the end of this. And there's not gonna be much content of the later levels because of how my internet's deciding to run like a piece of shit. So I'm gonna go enjoy anime while eating some food.